guessing you guys have all heard about Ashton Kutcher, right? Yeah. All right. Well, I've been researching him, and I'm going to give you a little insight on his life, his personal life, his career, and his business. He had a little bit of a rocky childhood and a really explosive career with a very successful, surprisingly successful business. So we're going to start off at the beginning with his early life. He, uh, Christopher Ashton Kutcher was born February 7th, 1978 in Cedar Rapids, Iowa. And he was born a little bit first before his twin brother, Michael, who actually was born with a, a heart, a septal heart condition where he had a hole in his heart. And later he actually had to have heart surgery due to a virus. His mother were Larry and Diane Kutcher. And shortly after he was born, he wasn't too old yet, they divorced and he moved off to live with his mom. So he did school, you know, did plays and whatnot. And it only took a year after he graduated for him to be noticed by a talent scout who introduced him to modeling. Modeling is what propelled Ashton into starting. He started off modeling for Abercrombie and Finch and Calvin Klein, and going up those roles gave him popularity, which landed him on his first big TV show, that 70s show. And that's where he really burst into fame. Uh, he, after that 70s show, he went to film a lot of his popular movies like A Lot Like Love, No Strings Attached, Guess Who, and The Guardian, which The Guardian is my favorite of his movies. If you haven't seen it, it's about him training to be a rescue swimmer in the Coast Guard and uh, trained by someone of a legend of the job. So he switched between film and TV. Most recently, he was in Two and a Half Men, which he actually boosted their ratings by almost you know, double their ratings. So, in his career, he jumped back and forth between modeling. He went back to modeling every once in a while, TV, film, and he even co-hosted and uh, was the host and produced some TV shows of his own. So, a lot of the roles he played were goofy, funny characters. So, whenever he said he was going to go into business, nobody paid attention. Well, he proved them all wrong because he went on to co-found a couple billion dollar companies. He co is the co-head of A Great Investments, which is a venture capital firm that uh, invests in startup companies. And his whole stick is he wants to invest in technological companies that will benefit people and help you know people in need. Also, he co-founded Thorn, which is a human rights organization whose whole goal is to eliminate. Uh, uh, child sex trafficking and child pornography using uh, technology that he's producing that company's producing so they've helped identify thousands of individuals and victims of this and they've actually helped rescue hundreds of children in these situations and most recently he um, he spoke in 2017 at the National Senate uh, Foreign Relations Committee about Thorn. So he was act and also because of all this, he was labeled as in the Time magazine as the world's one of the world's 100 most influential people. So to sum it up, basically, Ashton Kutcher is a lot really unexpected to some people who don't really know the business side of him. And I hope you guys learned a little bit about Ashton Kutcher, his kind of a rough childhood with his brother and his parents, and also his explosive career, which is very popular with movies and film, and his surprising business ventures that are very successful, which not a lot of people know about. So, hopefully you guys know a little bit more, and next time you see him on TV, you'll be able to kind of appreciate his acting more, because you'll be able to see, yes, he plays goofy characters, but you'll be able to see is how intelligent he really is. Thank you. Can I stop it? Yeah.